folks, I'm here at uh, Walk and Go in the city of Nottingham. Very, very busy here in Nottingham on the Thursday. Uh, so, see what we've got here in Walk and Go. You've got the classics, you've got the vegan, you've got street food, sides. Let's go and have a look, see what they've got, folks. Hey. Right, folks, forgot my lines. Um, I have you have seen for, if this is all edited right and I get it all correct. Um, I have come to a place in Nottingham called Walk and Go. I think they're playing on the uh, wash and go or walk and go, whatever they're playing on words, and I like that. I like the play on words, playing with words, changing things around, double meanings. Fucking love it. Fucking love it. Um, now, no doubt there'll be a few... Of, I can see you now. Now, no doubt there'll be a few of you out there going, oh, he's eating shit again. He's eating this again. He's eating that. Try eating healthy, blah, blah. Fuck off. Nobody's going to watch me eat a plate of vegetables. I tried that. I did a lovely big bowl. In fact, all those that moan about me eating this shit, go back and watch uh, where I prepared a big bowl of carrots and swede and celery and pickled onions and radishes and all the healthy stuff. Go back and watch that. And then when you want to watch it, something else like that, watch the fucker again, right? But mainly, people want to see you... Eating food. Oh, my battery's flashing. Oh, for fuck's sake. I knew it was going to do that. I, I knew, I knew it was going to do that. And I mean, do you actually think that's all I eat? Do you only really think I go out and I eat fast food all the time? Really? Do you think that that's all I do? I just go out and have KFC, McDonald's, Chinese, Indian, pizzas, kebabs. Do you think that's all I... And yes, I'm a fat fuck. Yes, I'm a fat fuck. I know that. But I don't just eat that all the while. I don't just sit there and say, June, are we having another takeaway tonight? No, we have actually proper food at home. You have seen some of our cooking videos. We actually eat proper food at home. Yeah? Right. So what I've done, I've been to Walk and Go... Um, they do, uh, Chinese food. Fucking size of that. That, I should have my scales. I should have... Fucking hell. It'll bloody kill me. Right, um, have to give me... That ain't fucking lemonade, is it? Since when has an orange been lemonade? Oh, it's a citrus. Oh, not citrus. Oh, you game marked down for that one already. I ordered seven up. I could have sworn I ordered a seven up. Did I order seven up? I said seven up. I said I want a lemonade. Oh, he's giving me otris. So that's what. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, never mind. 
It happens. Plays a tune. Bit like uh, Tom O'Connor back in the day. Name that tune. Now, I had one of these the other day at a place. Um, was it the motorway in Leicester? Uh, such and such like that, wasn't it? Oh, let me put that on there. I tell you what, that's that, that's that heavy. It might break me bloody little train. So, I had the uh, large classic box, one hot box. Um, you can't beat a hot box. So it's just noodles. Uh, I don't think anybody reviews noodles and stuff on uh, YouTube. I think it's uh, I'm the very first person to review noodles. Let's uh, let's tuck in. Mmm. Oh, that has got a bit of. Mmm. Oh look. Broccoli. Mmm. Oh, this is fucking nice. It has got some heat to it. My head on the sweatometer. I've only had a mouthful and a bit of broccoli, and I'm sweating. This is fucking hot. Mmm. It's got bits of carrot, onion, spattered on my hand, broccoli, um, pork, loads of. Mmm. Mmm. So, because it's got broccoli and carrots and stuff in it, is that healthy? Please put your comments down below. Mmm. Oh, fuck me. You know what this needs now? I should be eating this at home with my perfect draft because it's Oktoberfest. And if you go on to the uh, Beer Hawk website, you can get the bundle, right? And using the code PERFECTBVM, you get £29 off. Mm. Oh, this is good. This is really... This is fucking fabulous. Now... I've looked into Walk and Go, and apparently there's quite a few of the little restaurants all over the country. So please let me know what your Walk and Go is like. Who the fucking hell's that? We're getting demonetised. Mm. This has got the right amount of spice. Yes, it's hot, but yes or no, or yes, or whatever, it's not too hot that you can't enjoy it. It might sting on the way out. Now, the uh, one large classic box, it cost £8.90. Um, I was going to say that is quite pricey, but for the amount you get in it, and the quality of the food that's in there, I'd say it's about right. Mm. It very, really is good. Very, very good. Now, I'm going to put that down for a second. I'm going to have a swig on me, on my lemonade.
Isn't it funny how I can eat, I can drink that, but when it's beer, it's just not on. Right, so what else I had was the uh, panko prawns. Um, these cost me £4.40. Uh, you get four. £4.40 for panko prawns. Um, I think that's... I think that's taking the piss just a little bit. Um, yeah. They're all right. They're not the best to have. They're not the best. But they're certainly not worth £1.10 and a bit for prawns. This isn't one pound. This isn't about one pound, two point, one pound, ten, twelve point, fucking eight, whatever it is. I won't be having them again. I don't mind. I know prawns are expensive. I know things going up because of the pandemic and we can't get a lorry driver to deliver four fucking prawns. Well. That is taking the piss a little bit. That it is. So, what can go... Although your prawns are very nice... They're not fucking, they're not that fucking nice. Now, I've also had the chicken wings. Now, the chicken wings have cost me £5.30. Now, a few weeks ago, I went in, uh, to a place in Loughborough. I ordered some chicken wings and I didn't get the fucking chicken wings. Um, I did make sure I got the chicken wings this time. Um, now, I've got one, two... God, I'll eat them first and then. But that's what it is. Uh, for the visually impaired, it's a chicken wing covered in spice and breadcrumbs and all that kind of stuff. Let's tuck in part three. I didn't say part two, did I? Mm. Now, they're good. Once again... Five pound thirty, nice. How many have I got? Four chicken wings. No. No. Yes, very nice. But not about one pound fifty a fucking wing. You're taking the piss. You are taking the piss. My bottle drink was £1.90. So, it's like... So, I think what they should do is call it Wok and go back to the bank and get some more money. But they are nice. I suppose you know what, sometimes you're out and about, aren't you? And I'm quibbling. I would have put these down as £4.50 or something. I'm quibbling over 80 pence. But it's... It's what you think, isn't it? It's... You want... You want value for money. And although these are nice, I just don't think the £5.30 work nice. I know you've got to pay your staff. I know the bloody Nottingham Council's probably put up the tax and the, everything. Oh, it's just a fucking pain in the arse, isn't it, this world?
And I suppose they've got to make a living. Oh, I don't fucking know. Do you know what I'm trying to say, folks? The times are getting hard. Times are getting hard. People are struggling. And it seems that we're all, I don't know, we're having to pay for everything, aren't we? That's, oh, I don't fucking know. Um, in the actual restaurant, in the actual restaurant, there's a sit down bit, as you've seen, if I've edited this right, and it's takeaway, obviously, also I won't be sitting here in my fucking van. They do do a vegetarian option. Um, and, but I thought, no, sod it, I'm going to get meat. Because the way the world is going with the CO2 fucking shortage or whatever it is, short. Um, and the media trying to show us that there is no shelves of fucking meat in the supermarket. I went to uh, shop yesterday, there were loads of fucking meat. Loads of it. You open the papers up this morning, there's like blokes and women standing there looking at empty shelves of where the meat used to be. Sc <coughs> Excuse me. Scaremongering. Fuck them. Fucking scam. Until it actually happens, then report it. Don't go, might, could, and all that shit. Fucking media. All it is, is fucking clickbait. Clickbait for this. And if they have to use a thing, if they have to use words like might, could, possibly, and all that, then it shouldn't be allowed in the fucking paper. Mm. To be fair, they are nice. I'm impressed. I'm really impressed. Let's start this as a finished slow game. I'm impressed. I'm impressed with this. I mean, this is going to take you a while. It's, I'm not going to eat all this on camera, folks, because it's just going to be ridiculous. But that is really, really good. That is the best thing, and I think it is worth £8.90. The sides, no. Mm. Nice bits of pork in it. Oh, what's that? What's that bit there? Oh, it's got beef in it. Mmm. Beef and pork. Fucking fabulous. Absolutely fucking fabulous. I've got a rammy gob. Look at that. <sighs> Is that teriyaki? When you're a wrestler. Oh, fucking hell, this is gorgeous. Really, really good stuff. Well done um, to the people in Walk and Go. Fuck me, that rock. I can't eat that, that's too hot. And I don't mean hot as in spicy hot, but hot as in just too bloody hot to eat, temperature wise. Right, I did treat me, I did treat myself to a fortune cookie. Uh, tiger, tiger, fortune cookie. Look at me fucking teeth. So, let's see what my fortune will be. I'll tell you what my fortune is going to be. My teeth are going to be full of this fucking stuff. 
Right, here we go. So, oh. It looks like they forgot to put that one in, didn't they? Right. Opportunities surround you if you know where to look. What do you mean opportunities surround you if you know where to look? Well, if they surround me, I ain't got to fucking look anywhere, have I? What a stupid bloody fucking statement that is. <coughs> Bit dry, isn't it? I don't like eating that fucking baguette that bloody Greg's the other day. <clears throat> Fuck me, I think they've been left on the bloody counter since before a pandemic, as Charlie Mullins say. Mmm. Pack our thumbnail, Anna. There we go. Thumbnail. Tell you what, this is fucking nice, and it was good because there was a bloke went in with a guide dog, and um, very helpful to the bloke with the guide dog. Oh, this is fucking fabulous. How many now want Chinese food after watching me eat this? Put comments down below. Say, Dave, you bastard, I want a Chinese. Really good. Right, might take that back for Ginge. I don't want all the people calling me fat and eating this again, do I? Upsetting them. <sighs> right, folks. So, absolutely brilliant that were. I was well impressed with that. Um, really was good. Really, really good. Nice, wholesome food. Uh, as I've said before, I think the... Um, the uh, sides, a little bit expensive for what they are and yeah all right so uh well done to the lads in walk and go um the staff if the management gets to see this they were working hard they were doing a fantastic job the restaurant were nice and clean so to them the management to walk and go you charge too much for your sides laters